know what's real when the blue light glasses are going on. Good morning, everyone. Happy first day of classes. Today is Monday, August 31st. Um, it's 9.02. I'm about to hop in the shower because I have a hair mask in and I just want to take a shower and wake up. Um, I haven't been up this early in a long time. It's the first day and I have my first class meeting at um, 10 o'clock, but we have to kind of get on at like 9.45ish. So I'm gonna take a shower really quick and yeah, I was up till 2 a.m. watching YouTube videos because it just still hasn't hit me that the semester's starting. Um, clearly, not ready. And my nail broke last night, so we're not gonna talk about it. But actually, before I get in the shower, I'm gonna try to chug some water because I'm trying to drink my water before I have coffee, so. All right, guys, so my hair looks crazy right now. I'm trying to stretch out my curls, so I have these clips in my hair, so don't mind that. I just took a shower because I had a mask in last night, and I'm gonna go upstairs and <coughs> make some coffee it's 9 28 so i have like 15 ish minutes to get ready and then hop on the zoom I'll show you guys my outfit really quick um you know what my goal for this school year is to at least just change my pajamas i don't necessarily have to wear any like jeans even though some days i might want to but i don't really feel like dressing up today um so this is just a sweatshirt from american eagle if you guys didn't know i work there now so a lot of the clothes i'm gonna be wearing in my next couple of videos are gonna be from American Eagle because I just spend my money there now. Um, so yeah, it's super cute. It's like a muted tie dye, and then these shorts are from Walmart. They were like five dollars, and they have pockets. Yeah, let's go make some coffee. I'm also gonna put on my slippers. How cute they are. This candy yesterday from Bath and Body Works. Pumpkin vanilla cream. It smells so freaking good. My room smells like fall. It's amazing. All right, blue light glasses are on. Yeah, I'm not turning my um, camera on on the call because obviously it's like this. So yeah, that is not gonna happen today. But we don't have to. Okay, guys, I'm in the meeting. I'm in the meeting so weird like because last semester i never had to do any like meetings or anything like that so this is very different experience for me but kind of excited it'll give me a little bit more structure i feel like to classes and make them feel more real this semester because at least i'll see my classmates at least once a week and my teacher so <laughs> So updates, um, my blue light glasses have hella scratches in them so I'm not getting rid of them anymore because I thought they were dirty and I was trying to clean them and they're not even dirty, there's just a whole bunch of scratches on them. Um, so that's good, fun and fresh. My hair is still drying, um, so it's gonna stay like this for a while, sorry if it bothers you. But yeah, so I just did my first ever Microsoft Teams meeting for my Anatomy and Physiology 2 class. So that was kind of weird because my professor so basically, he was trying to, he has two different sections of AMP2 that he teaches, and he was trying to do both of them at, at one time. He was trying to like combine two different Microsoft team calls, but apparently you can't do that. So then he went back and forth between the classes, and it ended up taking like an hour when he only talked to us for like 20 minutes, which is fine. Like, I don't care. Like, it's not like I was doing anything else, because it kind of helped me like get used to the whole like um, Microsoft Teams app, because I've never used it before. Um, as I said earlier, my classes last semester, we didn't use um, Canvas. I mean, we used Canvas. We didn't use like Zoom or anything like that for my classes last semester. Um, so this is all pretty new to me. But 
yeah so what I'm gonna do now is um I never ended up doing so there was I was gonna do a video where I was like getting my together for fall semester and I was gonna do a whole bunch of organizing and like setting up calendar setting up my iPad setting up my computer setting up like Google Calendar stuff like that my planner and I never filmed that video because I was trying to soak up the last bit of summer okay I I was trying to just live my life give myself one last week but now that it is the 31st of August and my class has started I need to get it together so I'm gonna just incorporate some of those things that I wanted to do in this vlog um, I did a little to-do list um, I didn't I don't think I've shown you guys this planner but I know if you watch one of my last vlogs you would have known that I got a manifestation journal planner but I actually returned that to Amazon because I didn't really like it that much. I knew I wasn't going to use it. It was so pretty though and it was so cute and I love like the manifestation parts but like the weekly spreads just weren't, they weren't for like my taste in what I need in a planner. Um, this one's a day designer. It's a 2020 to 2021. I got this from Target. It was like $15 and what I love about this one is that I'll show you like a blank day that I didn't do. Like, so for each day you get the top three things you want to do. It gives you your schedule and it's like time block. It's from 6 a.m. to 8 p.m. Um, and then it's like the to-do list part. And then at the bottom, it's uh, like your tonight plans and then it's gratitude. And I think that's just for me. It also has a cute quote and then it has like room on the top if you need to put anything else. And I think that just for me, that's perfect for what I need. Um, I definitely want to make a manifestation journal for myself, but like I think that having a planner that's focused on like more productivity and stuff like that is just better for me personally. I don't know. I think this is just like the perfect size. Like it's the size of my hand. This one's just more of like day by day. But honestly though, I'm really excited to use this one this semester. Um, and yeah, so now I'm going to go onto Canvas and kind of see what other assignments I have to do today. And then we're going to get into more of the organizing and stuff like that. Coffee is cold. And yeah, I brought my ring light over here so it won't look as dark and so the quality will be better because one thing about my room is I don't have any windows down here and there's no natural light so it's really hard for my camera to like pick up good quality like pictures and stuff like that down here because there's no like light really. Especially in this corner of my desk is I need to like either have a permanent ring light over here for when I vlog and stuff or I don't know. what like service you guys use for college but my school we use canvas and I saw this TikTok that was basically like this girl found these color codes and changed the colors of her classes so I'm gonna show you guys what I want to do so here are the I'm only taking three classes but my college does like the interest groups and like the writing center in like a different color whatever so I want to change I like bio being green I always do like science classes green and then I always is this even focus and then I always do the like English classes pink because I like English. I know I'm weird. Um, but my medical terminology, okay, this color is ugly. So I'm definitely about to change that. Um, yeah, that's gross. So I figured out the website is called colorhex.com. And oh my goodness, they have such cute colors. So basically what you do is you just, um, my dashboard. So I'm going to change the other two, like field community group classes because i don't really want it, like those to be that color either i want to just mine all to be cute so well like this one okay so i click it you copy the color hex code so copy and then i'm gonna go here enter it and apply oh <gasps> that's so cute i'm changing these two because they're ugly That is cute. Is there a way I can like move them around? Okay, yeah. So then these are my main three classes that I'm taking. And then these two are just like the extra ones that I can't leave because the school puts me in them. Everybody in the school is in these ones. So yeah, guys, I'm excited about that. Shout out to um, Kimberly, whatever that last name says. I can't read it backwards on TikTok because that's how I found out how to do this. And thank you very much. I appreciate it. So now I'm going to just check that off my to-do list for today. So the next thing I'm going to do is organize my good notes. If you guys have watched any of my iPad videos, you guys know that I love good notes and I've converted to using that instead of notability. Um, and once I actually have content to learn for school, I will be doing a um how i take notes in my ipad video i know i said that in my last video like a week ago and i was like it's coming soon and then like it's been a week so um yeah but don't worry i'm not i didn't forget about it um but i just want to get my good notes ready but why did i do that all right so i'm just gonna open up good notes sorry if there's a noise in the background my fans on and i'm gonna add a new folder and then i'm gonna do anatomy 
physiology. We'll do two capital I's to make it fancy, you know. Two, English, 102, folder, and then medical term. Um, I wonder if I can change the colors of the folders. And within these folders, I'm gonna make a new notebook. I'm gonna try my best because last semester, um, let's do the cover, let's do a green one. I like this one, that's cute. That reminds me of a &P. like it looks like cells or something on it. I'll do this one, why not? And then I'm gonna do grid paper because I'm really trying to improve my handwriting on my notes, y'all, like notes. So there we go. So in my a folder, there's that. And then I'm gonna go ahead and move my syllabus in there because I just did that this morning. And then in, and I'm gonna put my medical term one in here. I'm also going to make a notes folder for medical terminology. I kind of like the wave one. Let's do that one. This is going to be notes for this. And I know for my A&P class, um, he's going to give us PowerPoints, so I'm debating on whether I even will have notes for that class, but even so. Um, I don't have my syllabus for English or anything yet, um, but I will have to import my book in here, which actually, let me see if I can find my book. Um, I always try to look for my books. Um, for free obviously before I have to pay for them so let me see where I can look at my books at okay I found the website so I'm just gonna search for my English book um let me see what that was called okay guys 20 minutes later I found my English book I'll leave the website like right here in the corner of the screen so if you guys need to find your books for free you can use this website um whoop, there it is Send that in there so that I can annotate and do all that stuff. And then just to show you guys, English folder and boom, there she is. Hey guys, so it's now like, um, this is falling over. Okay. Well, it's now like 11.45, 46. Um, I'm going to go upstairs now because I've been down here for like three hours and I'm hungry. So I'm going to go upstairs and make some food. Um, I don't even have any homework, so I don't really have any, like, assignments to do today. Um, I just really, my main goals for today were just to vlog and then kind of organize myself. Um, so yeah, I really did everything I needed to do today, honestly. Um, as you can see. So while I was in my class, I was organizing my pen case, um, for this semester. Um, so I'll just show you guys, like, what I did a little bit. It's nothing too fancy. I've had this one for years. It's from Amazon. I'll link that down below. But actually, speaking of Amazon, let me talk to y'all really quick. Speaking of Amazon, guys, I have an Amazon shop page now, which is crazy because, like, I feel like I'm such, like, a legit YouTuber. Um, I tried to sign up for one a couple months ago, and it wouldn't let me do it because I didn't have enough followers. But now, Amazon was like, okay, you can have a shop page with us. So anytime that I talk about anything that I get from Amazon, it's going to be linked in my shop page. So all you have to do is go on my description box below and then click the link it should be like amazon.com slash super something like that and everything that i get from amazon will be linked there like my blue light glasses my workout stuff like anything i've ever talked about getting from amazon is going to be on there so check that out it's super exciting i feel really legit now but let's go upstairs and make some food love this candle okay so i think i'm gonna make myself some eggs i took my clips out the front pieces are pretty dry but the back ones the roots are still dry and I don't want my hair to shrink up so I'm trying to like let them dry into that. So that's why it looks kind of weird right now. But I think for breakfast, I'm gonna make some eggs. I wish I could sleep that nice. But as I said, me and my dad are going to go to the store really quick. So I'm just going to throw some leggings on. Um, so I just went to the bathroom really quick because I had to pee. And I just put my hair up in this little like half up, half down thing. Um, yeah, and I just all the front pieces out. So I have like some definition to my face. And yeah, we're going to call it a day. Because for some reason like that, this part of my hair dries so weird. I don't, I literally don't understand why it does that. But yeah, I'm just going to do some eyebrows really quick and then do some mascara. 
just because I have like so much makeup and I just need to use it. Like it's not even about me trying to like look cute or anything. Like I literally just feel so bad because I have all this makeup that I never use. But yeah, we're about to go to America's Best because I don't know if I explained this or not yet, but I lost my glasses and honestly i've been wanting to try like one of those websites like you know like i buy direct i think it's like a lot of the websites that like youtubers get br uh, brand deals with um i kind of want to try one of those out just to see how it is because i feel like whenever i get glasses from america's best i feel like they're always kind of like ugly like i feel like all the cute ones are like the designer ones and they're like a hundred some dollars and i'm not trying to spend all that money on some glasses when i can get some cute ones from online for super cheap so I feel like just adding mascara makes you look so much more awake. Like I just look like I am alive now. Maybe while I'm out I can get some Dunkin'. Ah, yes. My battery's dying, I'll see you when I get home. Much, much, much later. Hi guys, it's currently like seven o'clock. Um, well like 6.50, whatever. I'm super tired. It's like a really rainy day here. And honestly, like I kind of just shot my productivity down. I'm not even gonna lie. But, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and end this video because all I'm going to do is probably watch some TikTok, watch some YouTube videos, and then I'm going to start editing my vlog from last week. Gosh, oh my gosh, 13 people voted. Yay. So I did a little community post and I asked which get, which days of the week would you guys prefer me to post? Either Tuesdays and Fridays, Mondays and Thursdays, or Sundays and Wednesdays. And the most votes are for Mondays and Thursdays. So that's interesting because today's Monday. So I should have asked this poll yesterday. So I'm going to get to editing on that note. Um, But yeah. Have a great semester, guys. Love you all. I'm definitely going to put out more vlogs and productive vlogs for you guys to keep you guys motivated and inspired because, honestly, last night I was literally feeling so unmotivated for the semester. But, like, after filming this morning and getting up and kind of, like, getting to work right after I woke up, I honestly feel a lot more motivated and kind of excited for the semester. And a big tip if you're feeling unmotivated is honestly to watch, like, productive vlogs on the internet. I have a lot of people that I love to watch. Um, I can leave a list of them down below if you need some more productive people to watch. But honestly, that's like the one thing that's really kept me productive and stuff, especially during quarantine and like this, the beginning stages of um, Corona and everything like that. Like honestly, just watching people be productive makes me want to be productive. And that's really just the biggest tip I could tell you is just to have inspiration. Follow people who are in your career field that you want to go into. Kind of see how they're living the life that you'll be living once you are done with school and stuff like that. Um... And yeah, I'm like dumb tired. So I'm going to go upstairs and go get to editing. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you give it a thumbs up. And comment down below the classes you're taking this semester. Because I would love to know and talk to you guys in the comments. And maybe we're all taking the same classes. We can like, you know, a turn it up in the comments or something. That was so weird. Anyways, I'm going to stop talking. Because clearly I'm not making any sense. But bye. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I hope to see y'all next time. Also, look at the Dorito stains on my hands. Cute. Yep. Kisses. Love y'all. Bye.